today is a great day where all of you are going to be officially declared that you are all graduating from this institution. In order to see this happening and give away the official document for each and every one of you we are with us, none other than a great academician, administrator, researcher, fourth thinker, and a person who has brought many changes as our chief guest, none other than Dr. Karsid Dapasar, the former Vice Chancellor of Vishweshwara Technological University. He graduated from Malnadu College of Engineering in the year 1981 with specialization of civil engineering and getting seventh rank then. And also MTech from IIT Chennai. Now then it was called as IIT Madras. Again, he has organized many international and national conferences and also he was a, also a resource person for many such conferences. Then visited uh, many countries as an expertise with, uh, with uh, the uh, aid of the government and also the foreign aid. Then again, he was instrumental in bringing the university to the limelight, especially with respect to the uh, KIIT National Award for Best Technical University in the year 2018. Then uh, another, with, another very important is Atal Ranking of Institution on Innovation Achievements. I think the first time uh, the institution entered into these awards. So it was recognized innovation and entrepreneurship development among the students and faculties. Then India Research Excellence Citation Award in the year 2021 to VTU. Then also first time that the university also got accredited by NAC. I think it, it, it was the first time, in fact, to get an accreditation by NAC. Then also entered into NIRF ranking, which is again a, a qualitative ranking methodology by the national ranking framework. So there also, overall category, if you look at it, stood 100 place. Then university category is 72 second uh, place. Then engineering category, 49th place. And management category, 76th rank. And if you see here, Always the colleges are ranked as the top colleges when they lie within 100 ranks. So therefore, when you see here, all the rankings are well within 100 only. That means, again, that credit goes to the way it has been taken forward, mentored, and worked. All that credit goes to our chief guest, Dr. Karsida Pasat. Also, we have with us Eng, visionary, driving force, and a lot of, you know, motivation, involvement. None other than our COO, Chief Operating Officer of the Nagarjuna Group of Institutions, as well as the member of the Nagarjuna Educational Society. And she has now come with a lot of visions. Recently, she visited many best institutions. So she has brought in so many things, and she has really already given a task to me to take, take those things forward. So that's the why you are seeing change. I think all of you all already were there when some changes were happening. And let me also assure you, maybe when you come as, as an alumni to this institution, you see many such changes. And that changes is happening is because of the driving force is none other than our Banu Madam. Madam, welcome to you also. So may I, may I ask our director Gopal Krishna sir to hand over a sapling to our Banu Madam. Also, let me welcome all my colleagues, the control of examination, all other HODs sitting on the dais, sitting off the dais, my all invitees, and the parents who have come to watch their what's receiving today, the provisional degree certificate. Welcome to each and every one of the parents of the what's of NCET. And very importantly, I also welcome all the students who are going to be officially declared graduates of this NCET autonomous institution affiliated to Vishweshwara Technological University. So welcome to each and every one of you, including all my colleagues who are sitting here. Let me again, once again, welcome all those. If I've forgotten anybody, I'm sorry. I welcome them also to this grand function. Thank you very much. The graduation day of the college has been called to distribute the provisional degree certificate upon the candidates of the Nagarjuna College of Engineering and Technology who have been certified worthy of the degrees by the Vishweshwaraya Technological University, Belgavi. 
I have great pleasure in declaring open this graduation day. The most important days in your life are the day you are born and the day you find out why. By the Mark Tavern, respected dignitaries, dignitaries on the dais and after the dais, it's my proud privilege to present the report of examination section for the year 2021. Our college was affiliated to a Vishweshwaraya Technological University, Belgaum, till 2014-15 batch and received an autonomous status in the year 2015-16. The college has implemented the national education policy as directed from the Vishweshwaraya Technological University for the academic year 2021 and the other years are in the old scheme of 2018. Presently, the fourth batch of autonomous students are graduating this year. The number of students qualified for their degrees are the, in the branch of electronics and communication engineering, 103 students. In the computer science engineering, 109 students. In information science and engineering, 52 students. Mechanical engineering, 54 students. In civil engineering, 98 students and Master of Business Administration as 43 students. I'll congratulate all the students who are qualified for the degree. Thank you, one and all. I am from the stream of information science. Uh, today we have a graduation day as I got placed as a first rank with CGP of 9.35. I am very happy today and I am very thankful to our principal and our HOD who is a supporter for everything. And I am thankful to our college and staff members and thank you all. I am Muna from uh, civil department. I got first rank in uh, civil uh, I got CGPA 9.4. Uh, thank you for the college and the staff. I am Niranjan, so I have secured first rank with CGPA 9.27 in the branch of Electronics and Communication Engineering. I am very happy and I am very thankful to the faculties and my parents and all my friends. Thank you so much. My dear graduates, proud parents, present media, invitees, ladies and gentlemen. I feel myself happy and honored to visit this institution, Nagarjuna College of Engineering and Technology. Today is a very momentous day for all of us, especially for the management and the faculty members. Feel proud in sending group of graduates from the portal of this institution to the real world. Now, we talk about many, many uh, technologies. The three things which are very important in your career or profession are going to be, and these are the three things which are going to rule the universe. They are artificial intelligence, automation, and micro-innovation. A computer science is not a specialized branch now. It is one of the basic branches of engineering. So now many of the universities and colleges are working towards uh, the program level institutions. The programs are there and in a program you will have professor from civil engineering working, professor from computer science working, professor from mechanical engineering working, professor from electronics and communication working. The departments are downplayed. So a time will come uh, that is the aspiration of National Education Policy 2020, wherein we downplay the departments and we upgrade the programs. So multidisciplinary, holistic education system is going to come. You must have more than one domain knowledge to perform in your society or in the job market. 
So that is the reason these programs become very, very critical and very, very important. So you have all such background in you. And now uh, the opportunities are wide open. You need to work, uh, struggle a bit, work hard, be smart, and you must have common sense. That is one thing, you know, which is missing uh, in many of the youngsters. The engineering is with more of common sense and more of uh, practical knowledge and more of understanding each other. So therefore, you cultivate those kind of knowledge domain in you and definitely you will be a very, very prospective uh, graduate and definitely you bring name and fame, not only your parents, on, on, uh, also to the institutes and your teachers. So stay connected with each one of uh, the group members and try to do uh, uh, well in your careers. With these words, I wish you all a very bright career. I conclude my graduation day speech. I once again congratulate you. Thank you all. Namaskara. Hello everyone. My name is Sai Shri and I'm from civil department. And um, today I'm graduating from NCT and thanks to this college. Now I'm from Nagarjuna, computer science department. I'm very happy to be graduated today. And I'm from civil department. I'm graduating today from Nagarjuna College of Engineering and Technology. And I'm feeling very wonderful from the things they have organized. And this is such a lovely atmosphere. Thank you. I am from EC, EC branch, so I am very happy to here for graduation day. I am very happy with my friends. Yeah, so actually we have studied four years from 2018 to 2022. It's a very good atmosphere. Then the way they the, the way they have teached us very well. It's very nice to be here and very very glad to part of the NCT. Thank you. My name is Kanchan from MBA department. Hi, I am Likita from MBA department. I thank the institution and the staff for celebrating such an uh, amazing occasion which is very uh, beautifully arranged and uh, I would like to thank the campus and the students for uh, being a part of this beautiful journey. Thank you. I am gratefully thanks for this NCET for organizing this uh, graduation day event uh, for our uh, MBA batch. I am Dr. M.B. Savesha, controller of examination of the Nagarjuna College of Engineering and Technology. I wish you all the best for all the students of 2018 to 22 batch and uh, I wish them a good success in their uh, future life. I am Dr. Vijayanand, HOD of uh, AML department. So I wish all the best to all the graduates and uh, past of students. Thank you. Hi, Ramesh Piers, HOD of Civil Engineering department. Wish you all the success in your future and endeavor in your careers. I, Dr. Nagesh Kayan. Professor and Head of Department of Electronics and Communication Engineering. All the best, dear students. I, Dr. Anil Kannu, Professor and uh, Head, IAC Department. All the best for your future. I, Dr. Manjunath K, Professor and Head, Department of Chemistry. I wish all the best for passing out students. Dearest passing out students, congratulations. Today, my advice to you is, uh, I would suggest you to develop a love for learning which would take you a long way ahead. Uh, being technology students uh, yourselves, I think uh, the rate at which technology is developing every day, I think it, should, it is extremely important for you to keep the pace and uh, keep learning every single day of your life. I think once you develop that uh, for yourselves, you will be great citizens uh, of India. And uh, having said that, all the very best for your future endeavors. Good luck.